This video will cover how to hide and suppress parts in an assembly. In big assemblies, it is sometimes useful to temporarily not show parts. In many cases, these parts may be covering other parts that you need to see. The hide and suppress commands are used to temporarily make parts and subassemblies invisible. There are important differences between hide and suppress. Hiding a part will only make the part invisible. It will still be calculated in the physical properties and if the assembly is inserted into a 2D drawing, the part will be shown. The suppress option will not only make the part invisible in the assembly workspace, the bounding box will also not be shown, but it will also exclude it from the physical properties calculations, and it will not be shown in a 2D drawing. To hide parts and or sub-assemblies, right-click on the part in the Design Explorer and select Hide or right-click on the part in the assembly workspace and select Hide. The part will not be displayed in the part workspace, but you will still be able to see the bounding box for that part, as well as the part name in the Design Explorer. This will be shown in gray in the Design Explorer. To show the part again, right-click on the name in the Design Explorer and select Hide. This will unhide the part. Hiding and unhiding can also be used for subassemblies and patterns, like this propeller assembly, for example. To suppress parts and or subassemblies, right-click on the part in the Design Explorer and select Suppress. Or, right-click on the part in the Assembly Workspace and select Suppress. The part will not be displayed in the Part Workspace, and you will not be able to see the bounding box for that part. The part or subassembly will be shown in gray in the Design Explorer. To show the part again, right-click on the name in the Design Explorer and select Suppress. This video covered how to hide and suppress parts in an assembly. The hide and suppress commands are used to temporarily make parts and subassemblies invisible. Hide maintains the physical properties of the hidden parts within an assembly. Suppress does not. Unlike a hidden part, a suppressed part will not be displayed in a 2D drawing. Hide will not affect associated assembly constraints. The affected assembly constraints for suppressed parts will not be shown or honored. 